Open up. Open up, Stacy. It's Tracy. So did you bump your head or what? Why are you knocking on my door like that? Like you don't have no sense, Tracy. What do you want? I only came over here. Stacy, Stacy, I only came over here because me and Shirley got into it. I know it's not your problem, but me and Shirley got into it and I told her when I come out to the building, I wanted to fight her because she really came at me. She's not answering the door. So I don't know what's going on. I don't know if she's home, if she's asleep, whatever. But I'm here. I don't know. Okay. That has nothing to do with me. Well, then go talk to Shirley. Why are you in my apartment? I already told you I didn't feel like speaking to you at the moment. Well, I don't know what to tell you. But anyways, with that, we used to be really cool, like, close and everything. And you just started talking to me because of Abby. But Abby's my best friend. I know, I know. I'm a part of you, but... I, I know she got him pregnant. I know, I know she got pregnant. But that has nothing to do with us or friendship. No, I know. And, okay, I understand she's your best friend. But we was friends way before you and Abby. And what got me mad is because Abby got pregnant. You sided with her. So that's like a slap in my face. And you wonder why I'm not mad? Mm-hmm. Okay, well, like you said, that's your best friend. And remember, you're the, I created you. You know, if it wasn't for me, you wouldn't have life, Tracy. But anyways, um, do what you gotta do with Shirley and that has nothing to do with me. Just get out of my apartment. Thank you. All right, well, you're wrong, Stacy. you're wrong. But if you want to be like that, then be like that. You're wrong. Okay, I'll be wrong. Just get out.